I've missed you so much. I'm thirsty. Do you want to go to my kitchen and help me find a drink? Let's go! Welcome to my kitchen! What are some things you like to drink? Let me hear them. Do you like water? Can you say water? What else do you like to drink? Do you like something that's white and it comes from cows? Yeah, milk. Can you say milk? Good job! How about juice? Do you like juice? Juice? Can you say juice? Good job! I'm gonna have some milk right now. Mmm, yummy milk. I think I want some more milk. Can you say more milk? Good job. All done. I'm done with my milk now. All done. Don't give me no pop, no pop. Don't give me no tea, no tea. Just give me that milk, moo, 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 whisper. Milk, moo, 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 moo. Give me a big M. M. Give me a little M. M. Give me a big I. I. Give me a little I. I. Give me a big L. L. Give me a little L. L. Give me a big K. K. Give me a little K. K. Give me a long M. M. Give me a short M. M. Give me a long I. I. Give me a short I. Give me a long L. L. Give me a short L. L. Give me a long K. K. Give me a short K. K. Don't give me no pop, no pop. Don't give me no T, no T. Just give me that milk, moo, 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 moo. Wisconsin milk, moo, 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 moo. Uh-oh, here's my spill. No big deal. I can just use some paper towel to wipe it. Wipe the spill. All clean. When we spill something, we might have to ask an adult for help. Can you say help? Help? Good job! Wipe, wipe, wipe your spill on the countertop. Accidents happen, no big deal. We can clean it up. Grab, grab, grab a towel, lay it on the mess. Then you wipe it back and forth, easy and no stress. Help, help, help a friend if they spill a drink. Teamwork makes things easier, it's funner than you think. Throw the paper towel away. Good job cleaning up. Cleaning up after yourself should make you very proud. Uh oh, another spill on the countertop. Accidents happen, no big deal. We can clean it up. Grab, grab, grab a towel, lay it on the mess. Then you wipe it back and forth, easy and no stress. Help, help, help a friend if they spill a drink. Teamwork makes things easier, it's funner than you think. Throw the paper towel away, good job cleaning up. Cleaning up after yourself should make you very proud. I'm not thirsty anymore. Now I'm hungry. Are you hungry? Let's make some pretend food with Play-Doh. Let's make some curly french fries out of Play-Doh. Wow, look at this. I'm gonna twist it and it's gonna make curly fries. What color should we make the fries? Let's use 
any color. It doesn't have to be the regular fry color. What color do you like? Cool. How about we try green? I have to take this green Play-Doh and roll it. I need to make it kind of like a snake so that I can fit it in my tool to make the curly fries. Let's see if it'll fit. All right, it does fit, nice. I have to go ahead and put a special cover on this part. Now it's time for the fun part. I need to turn this and the curly fries are gonna come out. Turning it, twisting it. Take some time. Oh, look, it's starting to come out. Oh, cool. Look, green curly fries. Let's do another color. Let's use orange next. Remember, first I need to roll it so that it'll fit inside my tool. All right, it's going in. Let's put a little bit more. And I think that's enough. Okay, let's do the fun part. Ready, set, go. Turn it. Here it goes. Cool. Let's add some ketchup. Squeeze. Hmm, what do you think? Does it look good? <laughs> Thanks for helping me make these french fries. Are you ready for some dessert? Cause I am. I want to bake some cookies. Yum! Cookies, cookies, I like to bake. Cookies, cookies, let's decorate. Dough in the cutters and frosting too. I even have some sprinkles for you. Roll it, roll it, let's roll the dough. We have to follow the steps, you know. Not too thick and not too thin. Right in the middle, I've got it, that's it. Cutters, cutters, cookie cutters. You might need help from your dad or mother. Stars and hearts or snowflakes too. Let's keep up the pace, we've got cutting to do. Bake them, bake them in the oven. I just can't wait, I know you'll love them. Set the timer and wait patiently. I smell something yummy, I think they're ready. Cool them, cool them, they are too hot. Look at these cookies, we made a lot. Almost time to decorate. I'm getting so hungry, I just can't wait. Frosting, frosting, let's spread it now. It's so soft, smooth, I'll show you how. Vanilla, chocolate, strawberry too. My favorite's vanilla, how about you? Sprinkle, sprinkle, so many colors. Sprinkle, sprinkles, I'll have another. Green and red and yellow and pink. Let's pick out our favorite. What do you think? Eat them, eat them, eat the cookies. Crunchy, tasty, they're so yummy. Baking cookies is so much fun. Let's do this again. Today we're all done. This looks so cool. Let's get to making these cookies.
I'm so excited to make these cookies. I don't even know where to begin. Okay, so we have different colors for the cookies. How about you say the colors with me when I point? Purple, blue, yellow, green, and pink. This is our cookie dough. And we have all of these different cutters to make the cool cookie shapes. Let's pick one of these cookie cutter shapes. It looks like we have a square. A circle, a star, and a heart. This is some other fun stuff we're gonna do after we cut the cookies. Which shape should we start with? Let's do the heart. I love hearts. I'm just gonna move these to the side. All right. Which color should we make this heart cookie? What do you think? I think any option would be really good. I'm gonna choose pink. What's the first thing we need to do? Can we just go like this? Put the heart on top of this ball? No, we need to roll the dough. It looks like we have a roller but this roller is gonna make different kinds of shapes and designs. And you know what? I don't think I want those right now. So instead, I'm gonna use my hand. I'm just gonna press down. Look at that, it's already looking good. I'm gonna make it even more flat. Not too thick and not too thin. All right, let's see if it's big enough. Okay, it looks good. I'm gonna go ahead and press down. This is gonna be so cute. Let's see. Okay, that's the extra stuff. I'm gonna push, yay, it's a heart. For now, I'm gonna leave this heart like this because I wanna do all of the decorating at the end. Which shape should we use next? Let's do the circle. Which color should we make this circle shaped cookie? Let's try yellow. This time I am gonna use the roller. All right, let's see how this goes. Roll. Ooh, this is so cool. Nice. Let's see if it'll fit. It does, okay. I'm gonna push down. Three, two, one. Look at that. Look at all those cool designs. I might not even have to do much more to this one. Which shape should we use next? The star or the square? Let's do the star. And which color? How about purple? I'm gonna flatten the dough with my hands because again, that roller has designs and I don't know if I want the designs for this one. All right, let's see if it's ready. Looks like it'll fit. Push. Ooh, yeah, cool star. Our last shape is the square. Should we use blue or green? Hmm, that's tough. I love both of those colors. Let's use blue this time.
All right. Press. Awesome. Time to put the cookies in the oven. We'll come back to decorating in a little bit. What are some other things we can bake? Uh-huh, yeah. What about muffins? Three little muffins in the bakery shop. You know, the kind with the honey and the nuts on top. Along came a boy with a penny to pay. Bought one muffin and ran away. And there were two little muffins in the bakery shop. You know, the kind with the honey and the nuts on top. Along came a boy with a penny to pay. Bought one muffin and ran away. And there was one little muffin in the bakery shop. You know, the kind with the honey and the nuts on top. Along came a boy with a penny to pay. Bought one muffin and ran away. And there were no little muffins in the bakery shop. You know, the kind with the honey and the nuts on top. Along came a boy with a penny to pay. And he said, what? No more muffins today? Here is my muffin pan. Now that we're done baking muffins, I wanted to do something fun with this. Do you want to play a game with this muffin pan? Okay, let's do it. I'm going to use this ladle right here to scoop up all these balls and put them in the muffin pan. Count with me. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, and 12. 12 balls fit inside the muffin pan. That's called a dozen. Now say the colors with me as I point to the balls. Ready? Yellow, pink, blue, red, Green, purple, pink, yellow, yellow, orange, green, yellow. Nice work. What are some other things you can bake? Yeah, totally. What about bread? Have you ever baked bread before? It's super cool. Next, we're gonna sing a song called Down to the Baker Shop. And in this song, my mom wants me to go to the baker shop to go get some bread. Can you sing Mi Re Do? Good job, try that again. Mi, re, do. Excellent. Now can you sing hop, hop, hop? Good. Now you're gonna hop when you sing that hop, hop, hop. Can you do it? Nice work. That's your job in this song. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. For my mother said, buy a loaf of bread. 
down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. Muffins, donuts, chocolate chip cookies, brownies, cheesecake, ice cream too. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. For my mother said, buy a loaf of bread. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. Strawberry shortcake, banana pudding, chocolate cake, apple pie, cobbler too. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. For my mother said, buy a loaf of bread. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. Carrot cake, Mississippi mud pie, creme brulee. Key lime pie, cake pops, cupcakes with sprinkles. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. For my mother said, buy a loaf of bread. Down to the baker shop, hop, hop, hop. It's finally time to decorate the cookies. Oh wow, look at all these different shapes and designs. This is gonna be a tough one. Ooh, you know what? Look, a leaf, I think leaves would look really cool on one of the cookies. Let's use this green to make some leaves. I'm gonna take a little bit of green and I'm gonna put it right inside the leaf shaped mold. I don't need too much because it's a really small leaf. I'm gonna flip it. Cool. Let me take off some of the extra. Push it under. Take a little bit off. Wow, look at this leaf. I'm gonna put it on the blue cookie. Cool. What about this star? What if I put the little star on top of the big star? Let me take off the extra. All right, let's put the little star and the big star. <laughs> Adorable. All right, let's decorate this heart now. Hmm. What should we put on the heart? Oh, I see a little heart. Maybe we can do what we did for the star where we can put a little one on the big one. I'm gonna use blue for the heart. I'm gonna take off the extra dough around it. The little heart is ready. Let's put it on the big heart. Oh, I'm gonna leave this one how it is because I already like the designs on it. What's this? We use this to make frosting. I need to put some dough inside here and then I'm gonna push it Frosting is gonna come out, so cool. I'm gonna start with purple frosting. For this one, you have to roll it like this and make a sort of snake shape. I need to put it in. And you know what? I think there's room for a little bit more, right? A little bit more. Roll it, put it in, okay. Let's try this. Hmm, I'm gonna put some frosting on this square one. Ready, go. Ooh, 
that looks delicious. Let's do the bottom too. Yummy frosting. Thanks so much for making pretend cookies with me. We had so many leftovers. Should we put our leftovers in some Tupperware? I need some help with my Tupperware. Can you help me match the lid to the right Tupperware? Thanks! Okay, it looks like I have this round bowl. What shape is it? It's a circle! Do you see a lid that's a circle? Is this one a circle? No. Is this one a circle? No. What about this one? Yes, it's a circle. Put the circle lid on. It fits. Thanks. What about this one? What shape is this container? It's a rectangle. Is this lid a rectangle? No. What about this one? Yeah, it looks perfect. Put the rectangle lid on. It fits. What shape is this container? It's a square. And what shape is this lid? A square. Put the square lid on. It fits perfectly. Nice job matching the lids to the Tupperware containers. Ooh, look at these cool utensils. Wait, I think I can actually use these to make some music. I need something else though. Do you know what I need? I need a pot or a pan. Okay, I've got one. Now we need to figure out which of these utensils makes the best sound on this pot. Let's give it a try. What's this? It's a spoon. Let's tap it on the pot and see if we like the sound. Cool! It's not too loud because this is made out of silicone. Let's try this spatula next. It's made out of metal, so it might sound a little different. Cool! Let's try this ladle next. It's made out of plastic. I like it. Let's try this rolling pin. It's made out of wood. Ooh, I love all these sounds. Which one should we choose for our song? Let me think. I think I'm actually gonna go with the ladle. Let's use this ladle to make a song. Let's practice some rhythms while we keep a beat. Can you say ta, 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 ta? Ta, ta, 
ta, ta. Nice. How about ta di ta di ta di ta? Ta di ta di ta di ta. Good. Now let's try ta di ta ta di ta. Ta di ta ta di ta. Nice job. Let's put that in our pots and pans song. With my pots and pans, I like to make, make music. Did you think I meant bake? You can make music with everyday things. Do it with me. Just follow my beat. Ta, 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 ta. Ta di, ta di, ta di, ta. Ta, ta, ta. Tadi ta, tadi ta. Ta, 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 ta. Tadi, tadi, tadi ta. Ta, 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 ta. Tadi, tadi, tadi ta. With my pots and pans, I like to make, make music. Did you think I meant bake? You can make music with everyday things. Freestyle, just play anything. Good job, keeping a beat. Sometimes I just want to eat a little simple snack. Do you like puffs? <laughs> Me too. I'm gonna snack on some puffs now. Be right back. What are these? They're pipe cleaners and they're all different colors. We're gonna take these pipe cleaners and put them in this puffs container. I poke some holes in here and that's definitely something an adult should do for you. What color is this pipe cleaner? It's green. Put the green one in. Ooh, that's kind of fun. What color is this one? It's purple. Put the purple one in. Ooh, it's kind of tricky when they're a little bit curly. What color is this one? It's yellow. Put the yellow one in. I really like doing this. What color is this one? Orange. Put the orange one in. Nice. What color is this one? It's red. And look at that. It kind of looks like half of a heart. Cool. Put the red one in. So much fun. I'm going to go ahead and finish these on my own time. Let's play I'm looking for something in the kitchen. I'm looking for something. I'm looking for something. Something that's purple. What do you see that's purple? I was looking at the grapes. I'm looking for something. I'm looking for something. Something that's green. What do you see that's green? Mm -hmm. 
I was looking at the mug. I'm looking for something. I'm looking for something. Something that's orange. What do you see that's orange? I was looking at the cat. I'm looking for something. I'm looking for something. Something that's pink. What do you see that's pink? I was looking at the sticky note. I'm looking for something. I'm looking for something. Something that's red. What do you see that's red? I was looking at the teapot. Good job finding all those colors. You're probably wondering why I'm sitting on the floor now, right? Well, I wanted to show you my fridge. Do you know what a fridge is used for? A refrigerator? Yeah, it's used to store food and keep the food cold and fresh. But you can also use it for other things too. This is made of stainless steel and it's magnetic. Isn't that so cool? That means I can use magnetic tiles to make cool patterns and pictures on my refrigerator. I'm going to use a bunch of different shapes to make a castle. I'm going to start with these big square tiles. They're really cool. It's like there's four squares inside of it to make one big square. I'm going to start with this blue color. Wow, that's so cool. It just sticks to the fridge. Next, I'm going to use this other blue color, a light blue and a dark blue. Next, I'm going to use a bunch of little squares. ready to move on to a new shape now because I want this castle to be kind of pointy. Hmm, which shape is kind of pointy? Triangles! Look, I'm done making my castle. That was so much fun and it was really cool to just stick these magnetic tiles right on my refrigerator. You don't have to use a refrigerator though. You can just do it on the floor or on your counter. Uh-oh, it looks like we made a mess on the floors after having so much fun in the kitchen. What can we use to clean up the mess on the floor? Yeah, we can use a broom, a vacuum, and even a mop. We'll be helping out our grown-ups around the house. We'll be helping out our grown-ups around the house. We'll be helping out our grown-ups. We'll be helping out We'll be helping out our grown-ups around the house. We will sweep up all the crumbs with a broom. We will sweep all of the crumbs with the broom. We will sweep all of the crumbs. We will sweep all of the crumbs. We will sweep all of the crumbs with the broom. We will vacuum up the mess that's on the rug. We will vacuum up the mess that's on the rug. We will vacuum up the mess. We will vacuum up the mess. We will vacuum. There you go. We will mop around the kitchen. There you go. We will mop around the kitchen.
such a good job. We will mop around the kitchen. We will mop around the kitchen. We will mop around the kitchen. How clean. We will wipe all of the counters with the towel. We will wipe all of the counters with the towel. We will wipe all of the counters. We will wipe all of the counters. We will wipe all of the counters with the towel. the dirty dishes in the sink. We will wash the dirty dishes in the sink. We will wash the dirty dishes. We will wash the dirty dishes. We will wash the dirty dishes in the sink. We will put away the dishes when they're dry. We will put away the dishes when they're dry. We will put away the dishes. We will put away the dishes. We will put away the dishes when they're dry. We will help to fold the laundry when it's clean. We will help to fold the laundry when it's clean. We will help to fold the laundry. We will help to fold the laundry. We will help to fold the laundry when it's clean. We will put away our laundry when it's folded. We will put away our laundry when it's folded. We will put away our laundry. We will put away our laundry. We will put away our laundry when it's folded. We will put away our toys before bed. We will put away our toys before bed. We will put away our toys. We will put away our toys. We will put away our toys before bed.